Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to find the current and power when a supply is applied to two coils connected in series. Now look at the sum. When a voltage of 100 watt at 50 hertz is applied to a choking coil A, a current taken is 8 ampere and the power is 120 watt. When the same supply is applied to the coil B, the current is 10 ampere and the power is 500 watt. Now watt current and power will be taken when 100 watt is applied to the two coils which is connected in series. So we need to find the current and power and this is the formula for current and power. Now go through these formulas for better understanding. First we will find the impedance. To find the impedance, we rewrite the formula in terms of voltage and current. Because the current and voltage is given. Now let's find for coil A. And now we substitute the value of voltage and current. We get the impedance value as 12.5. Next we need to find the resistance. The power formula can be rewritten using the Ohm's law as P equals I square into R. The power value is given. Similarly we know the current value. On substituting the value for power and current, we obtain the resistance of a coil A. Next, we need to find the reactance. Fortunately, if all the components are in series, we can use a simple formula. Z equals square root of R square plus X square. Now, squaring both sides, we get Z square equals square root of R square plus X square, the whole square. Now, the square and root get cancelled. Now, Z square equals R square plus X square. Now, taking R square on the left side, we get X square equals Z square minus R square. Now take root on both sides. On left side square and root get cancelled. Now we get X equals root of Z square minus R square. Here X is reactance. Now we know the formula for reactance. Apply the corresponding value so that we get the reactance value for coil A. Now let's find for coil B. The same formula is applied here. Now the impedance value obtained for coil B is 10 ohm. And the resistance we obtain is 5 ohm. And the reactance is 8.66 ohm. Now let's see when coil A and B are connected in series. When it is joined in series, to calculate the total resistance, add the two individual resistance connected in series. Now add the reactance of coil A and coil B to obtain the total reactance. And now we calculate the Z. And this is the formula to calculate the impedance. Substitute the corresponding values. And now we get the impedance value as 22.11 ohm. Now we are going to calculate the current and power. The formula for current is I equals V by Z. And we know the voltage value which is given in our sum. Z value is calculated which is 22.11. Now substitute these values in the formula and obtain the current value. Now the current value is 4.52 ampere. And the power formula is I square into R. And now we know the current value is 4.52. Now substitute the value in the formula so that we get the power value as 140 watt. And this is the current and power value when the supply of 100 watt is applied to the two coils connected in series.